Something strange is happening with the moon right now. Despite being relatively close to Earth and the major advancements made in space travel recently, the moon continues to be a big mystery to humanity. Weird things are now happening to our satellite, and a new study suggests that the moon is even more mysterious. In 2014, a YouTuber came across an image of the satellite's surface that showed a strange body-like object that looked like a creature. It had limbs, its shadow on the ground was clearly visible, and it appeared to be a large object. Isn't it horrifying? Today in this video, we will discuss the strange things that are happening with the moon. So guys, let's start with our topic. Apollo 16 UFO The Apollo 16 mission was the fifth successful moon landing mission. Since the landing on April 27, 1972, the astronauts have been able to capture a UFO on camera, making it one of the best UFO videos in history. It also features high-definition images of the object. Secret Military Base It has been possible to make many interesting discoveries with its assistance since 1994, when NASA launched the Automatic Interplanetary Station Clementine to study the Moon and the Earth from space. It may also have helped to reveal a significant weird to humanity on one of the images of the surface of the far side of the moon, where there is an object shaped like the Latin letter V. The object appeared brighter than its surroundings. Its shape appears too common for a natural object. It is located in a crater, which is also unique because it has a flat structure, and there is a hypothesis that it is a secret military base of the United States. Short-lived phenomena on the moon some old photographs of Stain Crater from 1975 year show a glowing object. A conspiracy theorist believe that there may be an object that is used by aliens to start their batteries on their UFO ships. Scientists report that strange glowing points appear here and there on the surface of the moon. In some areas, the glow is constantly observed, but it is impossible to predict when it disappears and reappears. It's also possible that the camera caught spontaneous phenomena but the original photo's flash was too small to study at the time because the substance of the phenomenon, which has been observed for many years, is still visible. A Strange Reflection Apollo 12 was the second successful manned mission to the moon, and many photographs were taken during that time. One such photograph, taken by astronaut Charles Peter Conrad and shared with us by his colleagues Alan Bean, carries a mystery. If you look closely, you can see the astronaut who took the photograph as well as another creature that is very blurry and has been the subject of many heated debates. Lunar Cylinder During one of the Apollo missions to the moon, one image was also captured. On the surface, there is something that resembles a man-made object that resembles a cylinder. For many years, scientists, skeptics, and regular people have tried to identify what exactly it is. Its size is unknown. It may be a massive object or an object about the size of a tin can. In any case, it does not fit into the lunar landscape at all. At the moment, no one knows what this object is or exactly how it got to the moon. Extraterrestrial Forces Neil Armstrong's crew and NASA's Flight Control Center spoke during the Apollo 11 mission, and Armstrong stated that his crew had seen evidence of extraterrestrial life and that they felt like they were being followed in 1979. All space agency personnel were aware of contact between Apollo 11 crew and extraterrestrial. According to Morris, a NASA communications specialist who worked on the development of the Apollo spacecraft, extraterrestrial ships are a technology much more advanced, and Neil Armstrong said they thought they had an alien base. Edgar Mitchell, a crew member of Apollo 14 in 2018, made the official announcement that he understood there was extraterrestrial life forms. He claimed there are diminutive humans with an extremely odd outward species. The Secret of the Reverse Side of the Moon The moon rotates around its axis, according to an algorithm that was developed under the influence of the Earth's tides. As a result, the moon always faces the Earth from one side. The first images of the moon's far side were sent to Earth by Soviet Luna 3 spacecraft in 1959. Later, during the Apollo 8 missions, it was discovered that the surface of the far side of the moon was not very different from the surface of the visible side, and it also contained the same craters. But the story has given rise to rumors that on the reverse side, there is a military base of aliens from other worlds, which most researchers refute because they have managed to obtain a large number of high-quality photos and have compiled a detailed map of the far side of the moon. Despite the fact that the far side of the moon is currently hidden from view, Scientists believe they have found a very straightforward approach to describing the surface that will help shed light on the history of evolution. They have developed a mathematical formula 
that enables them to investigate at least 25% of the moon's geographic and biological potential, including the far side plains. The reliefs of the visible and the reverse sides differ, with mountain ranges on the far side of the moon typically being 1.9 kilometers higher than the apparent, which is caused by a process that occurred during the moon's early evolution. Scientists developed a formula on gravity data gathered during the investigation of the basin of the South Pole, and the largest craters on the moon are not employed in evaluating Jupiter's tidal forces on its moon. Europa's surface is an ocean of molten rock, the same ocean that existed beneath the moon's surface roughly 4 billion years ago. This ocean was subjected to powerful tidal forces that persisted until the rocks consolidated and produced the contemporary relief of the lunar surface. Hypothesis Recent studies show that moon rocks are rich in radioactive materials such as uranium, thorium, and potassium. But they still can't explain the nature of the strange phenomena on the moons because most reports aren't supported by adequate experiments. And due to the lack of data, some really crazy theories about what's wrong with the moon begin to emerge, such as the assumption that it can explode, fire eruptions, light flares, and strange pulsations. If the moon explodes, it will shatter into pieces that will immediately head towards Earth, destroying everything in their path. Large fires will break out on Earth and it won't take them long to burn everything down. Those satellite pieces that miss the planet will form a beautiful ring system, but you and I won't be able to enjoy the magnificent view because we'll be dead by then. Hurricanes and storms will form and wash everything away. There's good news. In 2024, NASA plans to land a group of astronauts on the moon to explore the satellite and determine whether we should be concerned. However, this mission may be much more dangerous than we think. NASA has already worked on sending astronauts to the moon again by 2028, but the White House told NASA two years ago to move up its plans on Artemis mission and complete it by 2024. Let's just hope that our satellite avoids all potential planetary disasters because even if it is mysteriously vanishes without wiping out Earth, our lives would still be irreparably changed without the moon. The moon and Earth's relationship is more than just about the tides that occur. There are numerous myths and references associated with it. In addition, the moon is a crucial component of our popular culture. Without the moon, Jacob from Twilight wouldn't be able to turn. What would you miss most if the moon disappeared? Let us know in the comment section below. If you find this video interesting or informational, I would appreciate a like, a comment, and subscribe. And if you enjoy the video a lot, please consider sharing it on social networks. Bye guys, and see you soon in the next video.